Welcome to the Thunder Post Game Show. John Rohde alongside Thunder beat writer Darnell Mayberry. Thunder wins it 104-92 over the New York Knicks. It wasn't that close, folks. Thunder led by 23 at halftime, 31 midway through the third, and just kind of ran out the clock with a bunch of scrubs in the fourth. What'd you think? Oh, one disclaimer. No Carmelo Anthony. Kind of a big deal. Yeah, it's a very big deal, but still, I mean, Thunder's been taking advantage of, um, you know, players not being with their teams, at least, you know, stars or, or really good role players. So give the Thunder credit. I mean, they came out and jumped on this team early, led by 10 throughout the first quarter uh, for the most part, 27, like you said, at the half. You know, I think it was a nice win for the, for the Thunder, and they really did a good job moving the ball early, 16 assists on their first 25 field goals in the first half and you know Kevin Durant, Russell Westbrook and James Harden outscored the entire Knicks team uh, I think it was 53 to 47 at the half so you know I think it was a really good win for the Thunder. All right Thunder is now 11 and 2 one winners of six straight Darnell you're going with them uh, this week they're going to Boston to Washington to New Jersey sweet possibilities can they keep this going? Uh, they're definitely going to get Washington. I know that. Um, you know, Boston, I think that's going to be a tough, uh, tough game. Kendrick Perkins goes back to, to the place where he helped that team win a championship. Um, you know, Rajon Rondo is always a problem for this team. And they got some veteran leadership with uh, Kevin Garnett, Paul Pierce, uh, Ray Allen, of course. So uh, I think that's going to be the toughest game. And then New Jersey, you know, you got to figure that the Thunder will be able to handle business. I think they can even get all three, like you said, because they're on a really good roll right now, six in a row, uh, and they're, they're really playing well on both ends. Most impressively of all, as of anything, and you'll write about it tomorrow, is uh, in 13 games right now, the, the, the starters have sat the entire fourth quarter four times. Yeah, I mean, they, the Suns, Rockets, Spurs, uh, and then tonight uh, against these guys. So, you know, I just think as long as this season continues to have game after game after game and they, the schedule just doesn't let up any, sitting the starters in the fourth quarter is going to be really key for resting these guys going forward. All right, for the best Thunder coverage anywhere, keep it right here on newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoma.